founded over 100 years ago in 1898 by the Swiss engineer Eduard Zuglin. The company now known as Ed Zuglin AG has a well-known tradition of design and delivery of complex civil engineering projects. As a wholly owned subsidiary of Strabag SE, one of Europe's leading construction groups with over 75,000 employees, Ed Zublin AG's projects are planned, designed, and managed by qualified and highly motivated engineers and designers backed by a wealth of experienced administrative and management personnel. Our state-of-the-art plant and equipment in combination with extremely experienced and highly trained on-site personnel guarantees on-time performance and works to an international standard of safety and quality. Our offices are located around the world including Europe, the Middle East, Africa, North and South America, Australia and Asia. Ed Zublin AG Singapore branch has firmly established itself in Singapore and has been successfully delivering numerous tunneling projects for the island services and transportation sectors since year 1997. Zublin's uncompromising professional approach, technical expertise, and the ability to deliver on time and on budget was also recognized by the BCA Construction of Excellence Award in 2007. During the past three decades, Zublin has become one of the leading companies in tunnel construction. With its vast experience in the construction of tunnels in hard rock, as well as in soft soils with water-bearing strata, Ed Zublin AG Singapore Branch offered the optimum solution for the construction of the submarine gas transmission pipeline across the Jurong Channel. The proposed pipe jacking method would ensure no harm to the fragile marine environment, including the ocean's wildlife. During the construction stage, the busy marine traffic along the construction alignment would be maintained without any disruption and the existing utilities lying on the seabed were in no danger of being hit or cut by the construction activities. This particular challenge provided the opportunity to construct the longest tunnel ever built in one single drive by using the pipe jacking method in the Asian Pacific region. And with the award of the project to Zublin in 2011, the challenge was accepted. The tunnel, which has an internal diameter of two meters, starts from a launch shaft on Jurong Island and runs at a depth of 30 meters below ground level while crossing the Jurong Channel, where the water is 15 meters deep and the depth of the tunnel below the seabed is 15 meters. After 1,550 meters, the tunnel reaches the reception shaft located on the Singapore main island. Once commissioned, this tunnel will accommodate a 700 millimeter nominal diameter high pressure gas transmission pipeline connecting to the Singapore liquefied natural gas terminal. As with all other Zublin projects, safety is the number one priority. Training was carried out regularly to ensure that all employees were aware of the latest issues and were kept informed regarding what is happening in relation to safety and hazards in and around their worksite. Job safety and environmental analysis were carried out whenever a new task was about to be undertaken with daily risk assessments being carried out for each task. Works on site started on 23rd March 2011 with the construction of the temporary onshore jacking and receiving shafts. Both shafts were constructed by a circular diaphragm wall or D wall of 14 meters and 7.5 meters internal diameters respectively. The D wall panels were designed to form a circular shaft each extending to the depth of 41.5 meters from the existing ground into firm rock. Once the jacking shaft was completed, the tunnel boring machine was lowered into the shaft. The pipe jacking operations commenced on 15th August 2011. The reinforced concrete jacking pipes for the project were designed and produced by Zublin's precast factory. All required utilities for the tunneling operation, such as slurry lines, compressed air and cooling water were installed on the surface inside the jacking pipes. The pipes were then lowered one by one into the jacking shaft. The shaft was designed to accommodate two pipes at a time. The pipes were lowered onto the cradle of the main jacking station and the tunnel utilities were connected. Four hydraulic telescopic jacking cylinders, each with a capacity of up to 350 tons, pushed the pipes into the ground behind the TBM. 
The geology along the tunnel alignment consists of clayey, silty, and sandy soils derived from the weathering of the underlying bedrock. The rotating cutting wheel at the front of the tunnel boring machine, or TBM, excavated the soil and the rock. The collected material was then pumped through a slurry line installed in the tunnel to the surface where water and solids are separated and the clean water is pumped back to the TBM to start the process again. As the tunnel grew longer, intermediate jacking stations were installed. With these stations in position, shorter tunnel sections along the tunnel alignment could be moved independently, reducing the required jacking forces from the hydraulic rams at the jacking station. A total of nine intermediate jacking stations were installed in the tunnel, of which very few had to be activated during the construction works. Borehole results showed that the alignment of the tunnel would pass through bedrock consisting of hard sandstone and mudstone halfway through the drive. To accommodate the changes in geological conditions, Zublin utilized a custom-made and designed dual-mode tunnel boring machine equipped with cutting discs to ensure these ground conditions cause no problems during the drilling process. As the TBM approached the receiving shaft, preparations for the recovery of the machine commenced. On the 18th December 2011, the TBM eventually cut through the soft eye of the receiving shaft. Using a 400-ton mobile crane, the first section of the heavy 120-ton TBM was lifted from the receiving shaft. The longest single-drive tunnel ever built by pipejacking method in the Asian Pacific region was completed in only four months without any problems and one month ahead of schedule. This drive with a total length of 1.55 kilometers now ranks among the five longest single-drive tunnels worldwide and reconfirms Zublin's place amongst the world's elite tunneling companies. Once again, Zublin's dedication and expertise, commitment to safety and quality, and constant efforts towards continuous improvement and innovation has added a new chapter to our more than 100-year success story. And the story continues. For further information, we invite you to contact Zublin office in Singapore and discover more about why Zublin is one of the world's leading tunneling companies.